Our next stop is Green Bay, where it's also cold and sometimes windy, and the Packers are 4-8. and eight. They're playing in Chicago on Sunday before they get a much-needed bye week next week. Their quarterback is still Aaron Rodgers in spite of thumb and rib injuries, uh, but as their season spirals down the drain, Rodgers talking about the possibility of what could happen if and when they're eliminated. Look, I'd love to finish the season out, and, um, but I understand, you know, this is a business, and you know, there's a lot of us kind of older guys uh, who, you know, play a decent amount or they might want to see some younger guys play. So, you know, hopefully we don't have to have that conversation. But if that conversation comes up, you know, I'll approach that with an open mind and, and uh, you know, without any bitterness or resentment. You know, obviously, like I said, I want to win out. And, but, you know, I, I understand if we don't, that that's a possibility to have that conversation. So what he's talking about, right, is, is you saw Jordan Love there, who was the first-round pick two years ago, came in in relief of him when he got hurt uh, last week. So the conversation has been, at some point when they're eliminated, if they're eliminated, we assume they will be, do the Packers need to get a look at the young guy? Do they need to sit Aaron Rodgers down and get a look at the young guy? How do you think that goes? Yeah, I mean, I like what Aaron Rodgers is saying. He needs to approach it now with an open mind, but an open heart. I mean, I think he needs to allow some little love in, in the building, right? And I think Jordan Love, it's time for Jordan Love to be able to be evaluated, right? Because this is a young man that's sat behind Aaron Rodgers for three years, much like, you know, Aaron Rodgers sat behind Brett Favre for three years. But I think the time is now. I think, you know, even if Aaron Rodgers comes back, I don't think they're a legitimate threat to win a Super Bowl unless they make some major investments, something that, you know, Green Bay hasn't traditionally done. They don't spend top of the dollar to bring in outside guys. They kind of develop from inside. So unless they change their, their plan of, of – of doing business, then I think the best thing you can do is trade Aaron Rodgers. And, oh. Tim, I see you over there with that little hawk eye on oh. me. Listen, I think because you look at what Seattle got for, for, for Russell Wilson. What could you get for Aaron Rodgers? You can get two players, two first-round draft picks, and build a foundation to move this organization into the future. Moving on from, from a great quarterback is always difficult. And um, – it's never a right time. The Russell Wilson trade's not looking like a great It's looking great for Seattle. It's looking great for Seattle, though. <laughs> hey guys, look at what's that. It's looking look great for Seattle. <laughs> Seattle, 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 got, Seattle got their two starting tackles. Yeah. Uh, 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 should be a, a, a pro bowler this year. Yeah. And, and receiver, I mean, at, at – um, at a cornerback. Yeah, two starting cornerbacks. And they still – and they're going to have a high running pick. back. Uh, yeah, they're all – they're good. I, I – I mean, here's the deal with that, though. I mean, Russ wanted out both, both – Parties. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look, look, yeah. Look, I just think when I when I look at this, I don't know why we're in such a race to like, if you're the Green Bay Packers, to run Aaron out of the building. Like, I, I, I mean, here's the deal: he would have to walk away from sixty million dollars to retire. No. So like, like, I just I don't see him doing it. I don't care if he's made two hundred million dollars. Sixty million dollars is a lot of dough. So I just I don't see him walking away from it. I also don't see him walking away this year with this taste in his mouth of how this season has gone. And, like, I, I think the idea that you need to see Jordan Love, like, that was going to happen if Aaron didn't go and have two MVP seasons. Like, that, that's why you drafted him. It didn't work out. You misjudged the timing. Like, you don't need to make it worse by essentially benching Aaron Rodgers to figure out if you're going to go with Jordan Love in the future. Like, I just – I don't see it that way. Aaron Rodgers is one year removed from winning the MVP. Yes. He's two years from – removed from winning his one before that. Like, he's been that good. He could throw 45 touchdowns next year. Like, hey, maybe they go get T. Higgins. You know, maybe they go do something like that to make that a really good football team. I just, I want to be in a race to all of a sudden play a guy instead of Aaron Rodgers that I don't know. Look at what's happening in San Francisco. Oh, we got to get rid of Jimmy G because, like, he can't be the guy. Let's get Trey Lance. Trey Lance can't even stay healthy. Now they got Jimmy G back, and we're talking about, like, hey, they got a chance to go to the Super Bowl. Why are we so quick to run off Aaron Rodgers? Because you have to. Uh, well, listen, Aaron Rodgers, first of all, Aaron Rodgers was the one, you know, wavering in the offseason, yeah. going out and doing all. So, I mean, like, if you're Green Bay, do you want to continually be stuck in limbo? Like, okay, well, we got to we got to wait on Aaron Rodgers. What, what, what is Aaron Rodgers going to do? At some point, as an organization, yeah, don't you got to start? Back. Like, you like you play now, but you plan for the future. At some point, you got to see the guy that you traded up for as an organization. Right. You literally traded up for one specific player, and that was Jordan Love. You need to see what he can do, and you have the perfect hey, so out. Then, then you have don't the perfect sign him out. The deal you just signed him. That's to. what I'm saying. Sign him these, these deals don't mean anything. Come on. Yeah, he's, listen, he's, he's got do. 60 million guarantee. Listen, you want to make this decision after next season 
when you, you have them out, sure. You didn't but if you make it this year, if you make that decision this year, it, 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 the, 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 conditions, the, the conditions are perfect because he had a bad season. It's hard to tell to your fan base that, hey, you know, we, he had a good season. We're going to get rid of him. But the same thing happened with Brett Favre. Why, why did they get rid of Brett Favre? They got tired of him tired teasing. Of around. And they got tired of teasing sure. him teasing free uh, uh, retirement. And the same thing that Aaron is doing. And they had Aaron Rodgers. That okay, the and they may have Jordan Love. Listen, LaFleur, everybody was on board with bringing this young man in, so they must appreciate his talent. You think, now you have to develop and cultivate you're, you're it. You're saying that, like, like, like teams just have the decision on great players to be like, you know what, we're shutting you down. You guys both know that some guys earn we'll take, the right. We'll take ownership. To, yeah. and some guys that have earned it's, the right to be like, nope, I don't really care that you tell me you're shutting so me down. So he's basically like, saying, screw the future. No, he's saying he's got an open mind and no bitterness or resentment. <laughs> open your heart. I'm not sound like open, open your, your heart. heart. That's why I was love. looking at you. Open your heart. I was like, who is this guy talking about his heart and all this? That's why I was looking at open you. Open your heart. <laughs> what happened to Bart? <laughs> oh, you're, yeah. so, you're so rigid. That's all you ever hear about Aaron is that no bitterness and no resentment. such a tender heart. Bart Scott. <laughs> when we come back, we're going to talk about different.